Hello again viewers, we're at the Chinko Plaza Apartments, Lanzarote, Porto del Carmen. I'll tell you in a wee minute how much I paid for the room. I paid too much for this room. Could have got it cheaper yesterday, but that's another story viewers. Quite a nice complex. Um, I don't think the pools are heated. I did see some down it earlier on. I'll check out the temperature before I leave. I'm here for three nights. This is a uh, room 2230, I think. It's quite nice views. We're only maybe under five minute walk down to the promenade, all the bars and restaurants. A wee bit of a hilly location, but not too bad. I've got a surprise guest here. Hello, David. Hello, Kenneth. <laughs> Hello, YouTube. <laughs> That's my friend, David. So the two of us are staying here. I'll let you know how much we paid for it. I'll show you inside. I'll let you know who I booked it through. I booked it through booking.com. Normally, this apartment is actually cheapest to book through two. They do accommodation only. It's a one bedroom apartment. Sofa bed as well. TV's got lots of channels. I've not been able to find all the kind of UK based channels yet, but I'll flick through it at one point and um, see what they've got. It's got air conditioning, which is very important in the height of summer, I'd say. The actual room's very cool. I don't even think we need to turn it on, to be fair. So, it's not too bad. Plenty of charging points, as you can see. Microwave, loads of cooking facilities. Let's check, see if they've left me a wee bottle in the fridge. Oh, look at that, viewers. First time I actually got in. That's two apartments in a row. They've left a bottle of water, the basics. So well done, Chinko Plazas, for that. The one last night, Blue Bay Lanzarote, eh, they've done the same. So, no complaints, really, about this apartment. Twin beds. Charging points at the side as well. Don't know what the room view is like at the back here. I've not looked out, but the room view from the front is pretty good. Ah, oh, just looks out onto the main road. As if there's a wee cafe over there as well. Cost 24 euros in a taxi from Costa Teguise, in case you're wondering how much a taxi is. We could have got the bus, but uh, we just got lazy. There's two of us. We just decided to get the taxi. Uh, pillows, reasonably soft, not too bad. I think we've got a safe because I heard somebody speaking in the reception about it. Let's see. No, no safe. Unless I've missed it. No, 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 no safe. I'm going to show you the bathroom. Bathroom's pretty basic, standard. But, yeah, it is basic. It's got everything you need. No really complaints about this room, to, to be honest with you. I'll tell you what I paid for it just in a wee minute. I love yours. So, so viewers, paid £63 per night, so between the two of us, just over £30 per person, which is not too bad. Last night, obviously, paid £74 for all inclusive in the Blue Bay Lanzarote. That was a complete waste of money, to be honest with you, because we had one beer and we didn't even eat the food. I had a wee tiny bit of lunch, uh, breakfast, I had a wee tiny bit. The food's very poor in that hotel, uh, to be honest with you. It's just an average three star hotel, and the food. Is pretty basic but the actual accommodation inside was pretty reasonable similar standard to this no complaints and um, this is quite a nice complex i think i would recommend probably this complex should have booked it through two it was 52 pounds per night yesterday but myself and david just got caught up in course of tegizi going in different bars and chatting and we actually forgot about accommodation woke up this morning and they're like we've not got a hotel booked so we had to book it literally about an hour ago, check into ages, it's about 15 minutes to check in, I don't know what the issue was, but I was booked at the last minute, so maybe that was the issue. So, my first impressions of these apartments is they're perfectly acceptable, I'd recommend them if you get a good deal on them. I think the price is pretty standard, £50, £60 pound a night for Porto del Carmen, it's probably what you're going to expect to pay. I could have booked cheaper apartments two days ago for £35 pounds a night, they didn't have as good reviews as here, but they would have done us fine. But I left it too late, made a mistake. There you go, viewers. Thanks for watching. Uh, give it a wee thumbs up if you don't mind your way out. And new viewers, hit the wee subscribe button. I don't know if I mentioned this, it's absolutely free, it does not cost a penny. Subscribe to the channel. Everywhere I stay, I do a room review and I'll show you the hotels, give me an honest opinion. These apartments are perfectly fine, no complaints. See you in the next one.